Hey, what's up sisters? Long time no see. I have been extremely busy and I guess that's why I'm talking to you today about priorities. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Wendy. Hi. And I'm supposed to post videos on my channel every week, but I've been a little bit busy and I think I delayed for two weeks now. And I'm really trying my best to make it happen, but we'll get more into it, okay? So if it's your first time looking into my channel, be sure to check out my other videos because they're pretty, they're, they're way more fun than this. And also, if you've been watching my videos but you haven't already subscribed, please click on the subscribe button below, okay? That will mean a lot to me. So the reason that I haven't really been uploading videos or really talking to you a lot, it's because that I have been busy with my business. I actually started uh, an online shop that sells socks, bags, and some home and living stuff that can bring joy to your life. For example, I have really punny, cute socks that, you know, once you wear it on your, on your legs, you would feel so happy because they're so cute. And also like I've sourced for like some really cute diffusers and like basically things that will make your day and like will make living at home or like going out a little bit more fun and happy. Um, it all started because of my own mental health experience and I find that just adding a little bit of pop in your wardrobe or having some stuff to help you feel comfortable at home they actually makes you feel better when you have mental illnesses okay mental problems or when you're not feeling good so that's why I started my business but okay I shouldn't talk too much about that once I get started I can't stop um, it's called life doesn't suck.com you can check it out more below <laughs> I'm sorry I'm so distracted because I really love what I'm doing um, but it does bring a lot of stress because it is a business and you know I was having a lot of struggles with like sourcing my product suppliers and like you know trying to make sure my shipping doesn't like doesn't take too long and like things like that and and there's a lot of problems and I have to put in a lot of time in it and I do have a full-time job so to be able to juggle between my full-time job and my side business and YouTube and a thousand other things that I just need to do, it's almost impossible. And that was when I had to sit down and you know just list down all of the things that I want to do and to really just reevaluate my goals and what I want and to prioritize. Let me just go through my list for the past week when I was like so overwhelmed with so many things. So let me just show you what's on my mind last weekend. So I have my business, I have my blog, which is already 10 years old. I have my YouTube. I have this, there's this mental health event that I'm invited to go share. So I have to plan my script for that. I, my sister's wedding is next month and I'm the maid of honor and MC. So I had to think about that. And there's another family friend's wedding where she invited me to sing at in December so I have to plan for that it's six stuff already and I have to color my hair before my sister's wedding my hair is already really dull and I really don't like this and on top of that so because my business wasn't doing that good and I'm struggling quite financially I actually took up this um, basically I helped out with my friends to set up a few online stores that's another thing so that's like a part-time job and I had to get new chairs for my table. I actually got a new table and it's been super, it's like the best decision I made because it really helped me to really work at home. Because previously I was working in the dining table and or my bed and it wasn't as productive as I wanted it to be. And I've stolen this from my dining table downstairs and I feel bad for my housemate so I need to get a chair. So that is 10 things. Oh my God, there's 10 things, okay, over the weekend that I had in mind but I only had that much time. And of course, like these 10 things and I also have my full-time job, you know. <laughs> Sorry bosses, I'm still thinking about my job, just I also had a lot outside of my job. So, okay, there's 10 things and I really had to prioritize. So if you think about all this, like YouTube, as much as I like it and as much as I wanna keep myself comfortable for saying that I'm gonna post a video once a week, sometimes I just can't do it. And you know, it's also because of all this stress that I just don't feel inspired creatively to create a video. And you know, 
I just had it had to let it go. The thing about prioritizing and like having so much in your plate is sometimes it's hard to let go of things you love to do. So for example, I really love making videos or I really love my blog, but at that at this moment I am facing more troubles financially and I really want to grow that way and I think it is more important for me to do that first so that I can comfortably be restful and inspired to create more content on YouTube and my blog. So I had to take a rest. But that's it. It doesn't mean that I cannot be creating video like, you know, what I'm doing right now. I'm not giving up on YouTube completely. Instead, like right now, I'm posting a video maybe every other week or every other other week. Basically on weeks that I am more free, then I will try to make this work, you know. So if you don't see my video next week, please don't hate me or please don't think that, oh, she's such a liar. She says that she's gonna post every week, but she doesn't. Like, I'm trying and I hope you understand. For those of you who are struggling with having too much on your plate, I know you're already really stressed and you're already really busy, but I do, but I highly recommend you to just sit down and take a few deep breaths and list down all of the things that's on your mind that you think that you have to do. And then after that, reorder them in terms of priority. And you know, it doesn't mean that you have to neglect your other things. It's just that you have to, you know, play with your schedule and maybe sacrifice a little bit in terms of the frequency that you can do that and I'm sure you can do it. Okay, so that's my task for you this week. If you have too much on your plate, go list them down and go check out what you can do with them. And that's it for today. I hope you enjoy this short little video. Is it short? I'm not sure how much I'm gonna trim it out, but that's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!